The story of the Orient had been told in 1001 Nights, Literature and Art, and is mostly about savagery, myth and sexuality. All these concepts come together in this painting by French painter Jérôme, where you see an oriental dancer accompanied by musicians and surrounded by Bashi Bazouk, feared Ottoman warriors. So, what are the main themes here? First, male potency, rifles, visual emphasis of the fighter's crutches forming a line to hers and their hard gazes fixating and surrounding her. What else? Second, oriental male menace. The group men on the left margin, with their hard gaze and intensification by doubling, their broad arms, she is the only woman surrounded by men fixating her. And we see male figures in the shadows. And there's more. Oriental animality. Jerome suggests that this scenery happens in the streets of Cairo, an everyday scene in an especially rural interior. Despite that, you can find a comment on the hierarchy of races. Ethnic groups with darker skin were considered those closest to animality. This is hinted at by the dark-skinned fighter, euphorically clapping his hands, being most easily amused. Besides that, of course, all surrounding men seem bound by the movements of the dancer. What else? The oriental woman as sexualized center of attention. Her slightly mazy gaze representing the hypnotizing pull of her performance, showing her lower torso, breast and neck as a sign of vulnerability. What else? The mystic orient. Flowing textiles and overall theme of hypnosis and maze, the circling of the dancer's arms and the verve of her body. The foreign sensuality underlaid with the sound of oriental instruments. How authentic is this depiction of the Orient? Jérôme studied Cairo during his journey to Egypt in 1857. The detailed description of textiles, armory and instruments profit from these accurate observations. Some parts seem to be due to the artist's fantasy. His models, on the other hand, seem very generalized. It seems as if every ethnicity has one physiognomy. The watching Bashi Bazouk seem to have the same face and same facial expression, except for the man with darker skin, supposed to represent another ethnic group. The Ottoman governor of Egypt, Mohammed Ali Pasha, banned dancing performances in the streets in 1834. Hence, Jerome could not have witnessed the scene as he paints it. Nevertheless, it was a huge success at the Salon exhibition in 1864, where it got broad European audience and probably was perceived as a scene of customs. Jérôme painted many Orientalist images, and he was not the only one. Get more insights on Orientalism and European art history by clicking the link below.